a quick little update on the propitiation sculpture. I picked up this log while I was out running errands today. Uh, it's going to be the replacement base for the sculpture. Um, and I will work out the hole in here and whatnot uh, in the morning. Uh, it's currently one o'clock in the morning, but uh, before I go to church, I'll work out the the rest of the dimensions on this, and after church, I'll cut out everything on that, um, get that ready to receive the cross itself. This is the end of the cross. Uh, you can see the cross member there, grace on this side, mercy on that side. Anyhow, um, this two by four and that two by four will be uh, supports for the base to keep it level. Um, so I, I picked up that one while I was out in town. That one I've had for a couple of days. So that log in there is replacing this. That's trash now. Uh, also, I spray painted all of this side uh, and I put on my spacer here and while I was putting on my spacer it broke in half and so I had to kind of do some overkill on the screws uh, these two are holding the pieces in place and then these two were to fasten it originally so it is what it is it's going to be hidden it's only to keep the sash from uh, well hitting the vertical beam it's just going to be resting on it so these four screws will be completely hidden so in fact the only way to see it you'll have to bend down and look up and you'll only be able to see that bottom portion so because it will be at about uh, five feet up or thereabouts so anyhow there's that and then uh, it's supposed to rain tomorrow afternoon so that's why I spray painted this uh, is because it's warm it's a warm night I'd say it's about 70 degrees so that's ample uh, temperature for this to dry in fact this side already looks like it's beyond tacky yeah it's dry but this side is definitely still wet but anyhow um, in the afternoon after church if it's not raining yet I'll lift up uh, well I'll open up my unit here and I'll spray paint the other side of this and then um, all that I have left to do other than the sash is to figure out the base for the sculpture I've got the hands done finished those uh, earlier today well I say today but I mean Saturday it's currently Sunday but anyhow I finished those uh, early Saturday morning uh, and figured out the configuration that I'll need the nails in and I marked which one goes where so this is the left one uh, and I believe, yep, that one's the right one. You can see the little R there. And these stripes were uh, meant to be indicators for me to know uh, which uh, direction to point the stripes. So I figured out that the best uh, fitting was stripes facing down on both of them. So fits into that hole the best it doesn't have any uh, overlap on the edges there so it fits snugly and that's what I'm going for uh, but anyhow uh, got to figure out the base and other than that uh, I've got to nail the hands to the cross and figure out the placement with the sash and everything but that's easy 
<laughs> uh, oh, also, I have to finish this. And by finish, I mean, like, coat it in uh, uh, spar urethane or... Uh, is, yeah, that's a spar urethane. Uh, I'll either use this can, which is a rattle can, uh, or I've got that helmsman that I've had for a while, which is a brush on. Uh, and I'm more tempted to use that because uh, I want to get rid of it. <laughs> I, I, I use these on my bears. So anyhow, there's that. Uh, on this, that was about a half hours of work. Uh, getting, well, getting it out of that unit, moving it over to here, figuring out that spacer and then spray painting it uh, was just a half hour. Uh, picking up the base, well, this newer base, uh, I, I'm not counting that time, uh, but it was only a couple of minutes, so. In fact, this is literally the other half of the log that was that base, so. Thankfully, I didn't discard it. I do have to take care of some rocking there. I think I need to support this corner. Also, last year the judges were kind of harsh on me because the sculpture had cracks in it. I don't know how they'll feel about these cracks, uh, which go the length of it. <laughs> but I don't think that they're very deep. So, yeah, they're only a couple of inches deep. But anyhow, there's that. Um, but yeah. I'll figure all that out uh, in the afternoon and hopefully I'll have a good dry sunny day on Monday in other words tomorrow to work on this because it's going to take a lot of time uh, to shape it shape down the edges here I want to round those off plus I want to figure out which scriptures to put around this uh, I was making a, a bit of a tract uh, while I was down uh, getting ready to shower down at Love's and uh, I was thinking maybe some of those would be good for the base of this. Uh, you know, like the punishment of sin is death and Christ suffered that uh, punishment for us so that we don't have to. So, anyhow, there's that. That's enough of me ranting. I said this was going to be short, and it's eight minutes long. <laughs> so, half hour more of work. That's it. Thanks for looking. God bless.